Hello everybody, my name is Beck. Welcome to my channel or welcome back. So as the title suggests, I do have the latest Kindle Paper White. This is my very first Kindle. I did not expect myself to grab one. I don't usually film so late at night, but I didn't expect this parcel to arrive at my doorstep at 8.30 p.m. I was actually anticipating for it to come a little bit early, so I slapped on some makeup around 5 p.m. So I've just been, you know, wearing makeup for the sake of this video. I never expected myself to be the kind of person to buy kindle i've always liked reading books but not to the point where i could justify buying a e-reader and this was kind of on a whim even though i did do some minor researches i wouldn't say extensively i've watched a couple of videos here and there and i have concluded that i wanted the paper white version this is the 2021 edition it came out a couple of days ago as much as i enjoy reading i don't really like the mediums that i was using because i am using the ipad air which is last year's model and i've also been reading off my phone it's just not the most comfortable thing especially late at night i do enjoy holding a physical book and reading it i've actually finished reading this i read it off my phone first and then i decided to pick up the physical copies i'm not gonna eliminate all physical book purchases but as you can probably tell i am in a very small space i don't have enough room to buy any more books and i felt like that justification landed to this and the timing was impeccable because i had no idea the 2021 version was coming out and i just happened to stumble across it i would have bought the signature edition but the only reason why i didn't do it is because it's not out in australia yet i have to wait until the 10th of november by the time i upload this video i'm pretty sure the signature edition's out i don't use wireless um, chargers i have them for my phone and i have them for my other the portable devices but i never use them so that's not a major concern for me and 32 gigabytes isn't necessary for me and i weighed out the pros and cons because this alone was already like 239 dollars i didn't buy it on sale i was going to just buy the basic kindle but this one just happened to pop out and i saw it and just decided to take a leap of faith I don't know. There's some mixed reviews on the Australian Amazon website due to the fact that apparently there's like some connection issues with the Australian Amazon store. This is so unsatisfying. I completely like ripped it incorrectly. I also didn't buy a cover because it's like $50 for one and I think if I wait a little bit longer in the future I might have better options so for now I just have the Kindle itself. So it looks like that. So pretty straightforward so i'm assuming the charges in here but the kindle itself is this i'm kind of sad that there's no other color options besides black i've seen last year's edition comes in like a couple of different colors but this one i think there's only black maybe they'll release more colors out in the future and i'm thinking of putting a sticker here but yeah i have audible and i have kindle unlimited i'm on the trial period i'm considering extending it we'll see what happens but ta-da i think this is like the very first time i've held a kindle in my life and i already like smudged it a little bit but yeah looks like this i'm not quite sure what to do with it i don't think i'm gonna buy anything to cover it here because apparently it gives off a glare if you do that and let's just quickly look at the charger i guess just a uh, type c which is like one of the reasons why i gravitated towards this one i'm glad it's like type c because everything i own is type c so it's great to just bring out one charger if i ever go outside again the only thing i'm not gonna read is the instruction manual let's turn it on Apparently this process takes a while. So this is my very first time owning an e-reader so I don't know what to expect and I can't compare on contrast with previous models because never had an experience. I don't know anybody in person that has one with English. And then United Kingdom even though I'm Australian but there's only like two options. And then I, I know this process is going to take a little bit and then I have to go and find my 
Wi-Fi password. Yes, I've watched a couple of videos about it. If you're new to my channel and this is like the very first thing you've ever seen of mine, I post about video games. Okay, the Wi-Fi is set up. Now it's connecting to my Amazon. So I have to enter those details as well. Be right back again. I have fairly small hands, so I actually need both of them. I know this version is slightly larger than the older one. I can actually hold it just with one hand. The home button's at the bottom. This isn't a review video, but I'm just like giving you like a, a heads up. And my ring light is not helping the situation. But the last book I read was To Hate Adam Connor. I have made it three pages in and I don't know if I'm going to continue if I'm going to be honest. So I logged into my Amazon account, I've entered my Wi-Fi stuff, did have to enter my two-factor authentication before I could get in. I feel like a sense of security that you have, like an extra step that you got to do if you have two-factor on, it does work on the Kindle. So overall I have a seamless, flawless um, installation of the Kindle like I've watched from other people. And I have a bag of stickers that I can't wait to cover up the logo. I'm glad it doesn't have the giant Amazon logo on other versions. For a brief moment, I did consider getting the Oasis, but that was just way out of budget for me and not necessary. I just needed something lightweight like this that I could read. Hopefully, this might encourage me to read more. Hopefully, this makes my reading experience a lot better. I can't wait to use this later at night, but I'm going to let it fully charge before I do anything else. But that's it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this random Kindle unboxing video of mine. Leave a comment down below if you have anything you'd like to ask me or say to me. Hit the like button if you enjoy this video. And hit the subscribe button to watch more content that's not related to kindle i do talk about video games and other miscellaneous things i might bring this up once in a while i don't know the direction of my channel or where it's going i don't really focus on one thing but the majority of the time i guess it's gaming related but i will mention this from time to time anyway i hope you guys have a fantastic day i'll see you guys in my next video bye before i completely forget this is like my everyday bag that i've been using for the past couple of months i have a lot of stuff in my bag <gasps> perfect okay can't wait to use it outside goodbye